Hello, it's Paul here. I'm going to give you a really quick introduction to signing up for Zoho CRM for free in 2020. Uh, I'm going to walk you through the steps of signing up and, and what to do uh, straight after that. It'd be awesome if at this point you pause me and tell me why you're here. Tell me what you're looking to learn and I can point you in directions of different videos and I can show you some links to my free training if you want to come and join that as well. Everything's free at paulnicholson.com. So just pause me, tell me why you're here, tell me what you're looking to learn and um, we will get right into it after that. Right, so we're going to we're gonna go up and we're going to sign in for the free version. It might not say it on here, but if you go down here to uh, see our complete feature comparison, uh, Zoho CRM is free for free users, free for three. Uh, and you're going to get all these features that you're going to be able to use. Yes, further versions have got more features, but I'm guessing you understand what the free version is going to offer you, and we're going to dive right in and sign up for it. So you can come to zoe.com forward slash CRM to sign up, or if you want to give me some credit for sending you this way, zsignup.com forward slash CRM. Uh, CRM EU if you're doing it in Europe, but zsignup.com forward slash CRM, and it will play, bring you to my sign-up page where you can put in your company name, test 2020 limited, uh, paul2020, paulnicholson.com, uh, add a password, don't read it out loud like you've done before, put your phone number in, um, and... If you're gonna, you've got to agree to terms. I would like to receive marketing communications from Zoe and their partners. I don't want it. If you want it, tick it, and you will sign up. No credit card, no um, other information asked, other than email, phone number, and company name. Right, and we're in again. It's going to ask you your company name. I'm not sure why it asks you it again, but it does. So um, let me turn sound off. I just got an email confirmation. Uh, poll test. 2020 limited something like that phone number it'll populate you, your phone number and things in places you need it your current time zone is pacific language english uh, i obviously want to change that to gmt or wherever you are gmt let's just type in london london there you go i'm not in london i'm up north language you want to change it currency if you want to change it so you want to be in us dollars Obviously, type in uh, United. Oh my God, United States. Right, change it so it's in whatever your local is. Do you want to import local sample data? I'm going to show you to import it. I'm going to show you how to remove it, so you can tick it or not. I would say tick it if you're just playing around to start with. If you know what you're doing, uncheck that box. Right, get started. That's us signed up. No credit card, no information asked, and we're diving in. Right. Sorry, I've just I've just um, uh, clicked off. There was a box here saying your data has been imported. So you're now in, and it says, "Do you want to quick show a quick tour?" This is the point where you've either come from my other video where I've introduced Zoho CRM, or I'm going to link to a video where I give you a full tour of Zoho CRM. Right. So at this point, I'm not going to show you everything. Right. I'm going to show you information that's already in here's the here's the test data right and i'm going to show you how to change the uh, to remove the test data and how to turn off your trial right so firstly test data go up to setup here and now let me remember where it is here it is data administration remove sample data so if you've put that sample data in remove it yes proceed and it will remove that data okay Right, you'll also see up here, um, Enterprise, right? And you're going to see here, Try Other Editions. Enterprise trial expires in 15 days. So tinker with whatever you want to do. I'm not sure if editing custom fields and everything still carries through, but you can certainly try if you want to do all that sort of stuff and then downgrade to the free version. But if you are never, if you're never going to pay for Zoho CRM, then... Just straight off, change the trial to the free version, right? So go up to the to the little image of your icon, your little um, uh, profile image up the top there. Enter by, it says, Enterprise Trials uh, expires in 15 days. Try other editions uh, and 
Trial of Edition, switch to the free version, right here. Switch to the free version. I understand to cancel. You're about to cancel your enterprise trial. Your subscription will be switched back to free. I understand. There is no point in you trialing something you have no pl no plans to pay for. And then you have all these features get removed uh, when your trial expires, right? So that's how you do it. You've signed up. You are in. Now look at my other videos. Uh, dive into my free training. Sorry, I timestamped that there. That's why I paused you. If you come to paulnicholson.com and you go here to free training. I don't know why. I've got, I can't go. I've got to change this advert. Uh, come to free training. The Zoho CRM Bootcamp is where you're going to learn everything about Zoho CRM. There's a certification course there as well. There's also a new user, Zoho um, training course. If I go here and type new user, there's a new user, Zoho CRM. So if you've got any staff you need to train, send them into the new user training course. There's a certificate there as well. Uh, and I have a Zoho CRM forum. It's all 100% free where you can dive in and ask any Zoho CRM questions. So I know that I've jumped through quickly. It's very simple to sign up for Zoho CRM. Now we need to get into the, the uh, nitty gritty of exactly how you're going to use it. So come to my free training, come to my free forum uh, and let's, let's talk more, right? See you soon.